I love that the United Methodist Church allows us to bring our whole selves into the space of worship. Um, not just who we are, but what we think, what we dream, what we believe. It allows us to be our full selves. That was something that I didn't grow up with. To, uh, with the church foundation that I grew up in, they asked me to be something that I really wasn't. And it felt like I had to be somebody else if I was gonna be a follower of Jesus. I hope that we can remember who we are, and that we can remember that we are a diverse people that we're a people who uses all of ourselves uh, when things come up uh, that maybe want to cause division. We remember that it's not just our brains that worship God, but it's our hearts, it's our bodies, it's our soul. And so just, I'm really hoping that in the future of the United Methodist Church, we can be soul-filled people, people that seek God with the deepest parts of ourselves and not just maybe what we think. There's this idea of, of completely um, innovating what we do next in ministry from, from top to bottom. How can we reach people where they're at, where they're congregating, um, where their children are, where they're spending their hours after work? Uh, can we be church there? Can we bring a gospel message, a message of hope? Because I know right now that's what all of my neighbors need to know that they're okay. They need to know that there is still light and hope in the world. And we have the opportunity to be the church right where they are at. And so how can we do that in a completely new way? And I'm excited to think about recreating church um, from the bottom up.